This is your prayer today with Brother John Baptist. Until Job asked God, what's my problem? What's my problem? After Job becoming sick, losing all the children, losing all the monies and wealth, he comes to his senses. When the woman is like, please deny God and die. <laughs> Women, deny God and die. And Job is like, now, I think I need to know my problem. And God is like, yes, Job. Now there is this animal. There is this spirit. I created the day I created you. It's one of the spirits I love most. I treasure seeing. And its name is Behomoth. Behomoth. He enjoys your tears. As you cry, Behomoth gets something to eat. As you starve, as you are in anguish, Behomoth is happy. And God is like, Behomoth has its strength in the West. I'm the one who created. Its stomach is full of muscles that not even a thorn can pass. Its bones are made of iron and bronze. Bronze is one of the strongest metals. Job is listening. And God is introducing this spirit, all this animal that was created on the day Job was created. It is even said that in the film Titanic, it's this behemoth that was killing the children of God. It's alleged also that even Goliath had been taken over this spirit. It's a killing spirit. It kills children and in masses, as you can see in Titanic. So when you look at Job 40, chapter 40, verses 15, God introduces this animal to Job. Introduces this spirit to Job. That you do everything, cry in your room, but get to know that you are the one to fight. And God tells Job, no one can come closer to this animal. No one can come to this spirit unless it's creator with a sword. With a sword. No one can come to this animal apart from its creator. And this creator must have a sword. That not even God can come closer to it without a sword. I know many of you are dreaming about this animal. I want to pray with you. That stop crying. John 10, 34. God alerts you that you are the creator. You are God. And you have the sword, the blood, and the name Jesus Christ. I say you have the sword in your hand, the blood, and the name Jesus Christ. And all the targets, parts, you are supposed to fight this animal that has been destroying your business, has been destroying your money, has been destroying your children, has made you sick. The Bible says that Job suffered a terrible skin disease, smearing that even the dogs could come and, 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 and lick the wounds. I want to pray with you this morning that with the blood of the Lord Jesus Christ, I break Behomoth's waist. When this animal comes to you, 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 lose, you lose energy right from down. I melt the bones with the blood of the Lord Jesus Christ. I smash this animal into pieces with the word of the Lord Jesus Christ that leave my people now. Leave their wealth now. Leave their wealth now. 
leave their children. Many of you are losing children. Other children are not dying, but they are becoming wasted. And it's like they are dead also. In Jesus Christ, my name, leave my people. In Jesus Christ, Behomoth, Behomoth, the Lord has told me, you made Job suffer. You made Job lose everything. Now that I have seen you in the same way, I am the Job today. You are the Job outside there. There's a way you are suffering like that of Job. There's a way you are crying in your room. There's a way your marriage is attacked. I command Behomoth to leave your marriage, in Jesus Christ, mighty name. Behomoth, leave my people's marriage. Leave their families. Leave their children to the cross of the Lord Jesus Christ. I have commanded life after Behomoth. As Job regained whatever he had lost after fighting this spirit in the word, in the same way, may he also re regain whatever that has been lost, whatever you have been seeing be being lost, I retrieve in Jesus Christ's mighty name. I retrieve in Jesus Christ's mighty name. I retrieve in Jesus Christ's mighty name. Yes, I remain your brother, John Baptist Baliruno. Thank you for listening. Be free. Be free. Be free. And be free forever. In Jesus Christ's mighty name.